this opportunity to explain the meaning of House of Prayer Healing Ministry of God. By God's grace, I am the General Overseer of House of Prayer Healing Ministry of God. I would like to explain how this church started. This church started when I was in Nigeria. After my ordination, I decided to take the ministry of God outside the country. Because when I was 17 years, Rohan Bonki gave me a revelation of becoming a man of God when it was not in my mind. And he told me that he saw me traveling outside the country, healing people, praying for people. Rohan Bonki. So when that came of age, when I came of age, when I was ordained as a man of God, then I decided to follow my vision, to follow my revelation being given to me by Rohan Bonki. So the first play that came into my mind. By the Spirit. Was to go to Arab countries to preach the word of God. So in the process of that, I managed to have a contact. Without knowing it was a wrong contact. We have a wrong a, a contact to go to Libya to start a ministry. So the contact happened that you have to follow to Niger Republic and travel to Libya. According to them, they say from Niger we can enter flight to Libya. So unfortunately to us, when I got to the jail, it happened that it is now a, 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 using it. We cut across Sahara Desert, which we used to Duruku from Duruku. It's a long process. So on the process of that journey, we find ourselves stuck in Sahara Desert. 38 people in number, stuck in Sahara Desert. Every day people are dying, to the extent we remain only three. When we remain three, we keep on praying, I keep on praying with the people that we are there. So our people from my village, my community, we are praying on the process of that. One particular day, I had a revelation that out of those three people remaining, the only one person will remain. I had what those other people, two people said. They said if there is anyone that remains, it's me because I'm always praying. So I claim it by faith. Unfortunately to them, they couldn't make it. But I remember one thing that happened on my last day when I was the only one remaining. I saw a water when I was praying in the Sahara Desert. And the imaginable thing that happened that I've never experienced before. When I saw this water, I saw Jerichan, three Jerichan did. I managed to thank God and I managed to fetch the water. I drank as I could. But to my greatest surprise, after drinking those water, the water disappeared. That kept me scared. I ran away from that particular angle, but I was running very faster than like someone who was running, something was coming after him. So unfortunately, where I find myself, I was lying down there. When I opened my eyes, Physically, I found that where I was lying down was different kind of sandy soil with different colors, it was shiny. When I look at it, I felt that I can use this as a science student to make up something very nice that can help a human be. So when I was picking those sandy soil, a heavy wind started. And this heavy wind started turning me around. I was very surprised. I was helpless when the wind was turning me around. Finally, when, I, when those sand threw away from my hand, I find myself lying down on the ground. The voice I heard would say, Only by prayer, my people will be healed. Only by prayer, my people will be healed. The third time the voice came, it came with a verse in the, in the Bible, which says in the book of Isaiah, chapter 56, verse 7, Only by prayer, my people will be healed. So after what happened in Sahara Desert, by God's grace, I survived by the soldier that lies in the heart desert, they took me and they treated me. I find myself in Libya. I open the chapter and what the chapter says, I will take you to my secret hill called House of Prayer. In that place, whatever thing you ask, whatever thing you tell in my altar shall be accepted. So from that day, the name of the ministry became House of Prayer Healing Ministry of God. And since then, whosoever that stepped into House of Prayer the Ministry of God, with any demand, with anything you ask for God, you must receive it. They have been receiving it. So it's not by... Mankind power is not by any magician or whatever, but it's by God's own power. It is his revelation. It is what he promised me in Sahara Desert. That before I survive, he said to me, only by praying they will be healed. 
So whosoever are seeking problem, you are in plan of any trouble, when you come there to ask for anything, the answer must come because it is a promise of God. So I want to speak to you if you are sorry about the way. Try to locate this ministry. Call a house of prayer he let the ministry of God. And ask for anything that you want and you shall see. This was a promise God made to me. Sahara Desert when he gave me life. I want to fight you wherever you are. Come and receive whatever thing you ask. House of prayer is where you come to ask for anything and pray for anything and you receive anything that you are looking for. And I want to tell you that the House of Prayer have branches now in Zambia, Lesotho, and in South Africa. South Africa is the headquarters in the number 20 South Del Drive. Number 20 South Del Drive, Joburg, South Africa. Visit a House of Prayer and make your divine from God. It comes from heaven above. You shall receive. God bless you. Thank you very much.